Hello, 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 it's Dolly, and this is a recap of using the Urban Collection from Close to My Heart. I completed seven layouts and five cards using the workshop kit, and this is all that I have left over, plus, of course, the stamp. So I have a little bit wood veneer these little bit of scraps and that is also includes me using some of the scraps because I messed up a couple of times on my cutting but just twice isn't which isn't bad for my first time using a workshop kit per the instructions and look at all the stickers are gone whoops take that back there is one sticker here right there that's it that's all that's left now let's relook at the layouts. All right. Layout one, single page layout. I still need to do my journaling here. Uh, of course, there's stamping, there's stickers, and then I added a couple of my own embellishments and then also some splatters. For whatever reason, this kit was drawing me in to use. Um, my ink sprays. So you'll see that I used a lot of the Heidi Swap in navy and then I used some Heidi Swap in the black. So this is a single page. That's one. Here is page two which is a double page. Let me move some of this stuff out of the way. And that is one side and that is the other. So, so that's number three. So this is two and three, and this is a double page. That's three 12 by 12 layouts. Here's number four. Again, I have a again I have process videos for every single one of these layouts, so I'm not going in details. All you need to do is go to my channel and look for it's tagged as the Arban. Um, Arban, Urban, Urban collection so urban collection I'm sorry I did add a little bit of my own stash right here and right here but that's page four and page five so that's page five of a double spread and this is at my little guy's soccer game you may not be able to may not get it all in the frame and then this is the last one this one I went too overboard on my splatters. Just my opinion. I normally don't do that much splatters, but I was kind of mimicking the rain. So this would be layout number six, and it's a double spread. And this is seven. So this is me walking, taking a walk up at our mountain property, and it was raining in April of 2019 and the bridge is flooding over and I've documented that a few times because it happened several times at different times. <laughs> so that's seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Then I made five cards. So we have one card, two card, three card, four cards. So we can get that. You see that? Four cards. And then the fifth card. So these are more like masculine type cards or boys cards so they'll come in handy for my little guy and my nephews you never know maybe I'll send something to my husband or my husband's work all right that's it and then the next kit that I will be working with is called um, spruce spruced up spruced up by close to my heart all right I will have all the product information listed below, so if you see anything that you like, you can come shop with me. I am a consultant. You can buy the stamp individually. You can buy the pattern paper. 
individually. This would be like the pattern paper. You can buy the pattern paper with the sticker sheet. You would get the sticker sheet. You can buy just the cardstock, coordinating cardstock, and you can buy the wood veneer separately. And I've stated this in all the videos that I filmed creating each of these layouts. And then you will also get the complete instructions, cutting instructions. So that's all the layouts that you create. And of course, I added my own twist. These are the cutting instructions. As I stated before, you cut up, make your piles. See, and I even numbered my piles. So look at, just so that you know. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then nine, ten. I forgot. And then I made them, and then I assembled them. Um, that's required. Sorry for my dog. All right. And then you just go through and create all your layouts. I put them all together. All right. We'll see you next time. Bye.